Alright, welcome to part two now. It's just more looking on this thing. Uh, so yeah, neat little thing here. In fact, you know what, let's do this. Let's go into, uh, it's 2.47 a.m. Oh, there it's pirate. Okay, well, there we are in the daytime and, uh, grotto thing, but yeah. Turn the light off. Really good looking weapon. It has a little bit of scratches and everything, as, uh, I guess it's being used by, uh, the Federation skeleton over there. And yeah, it's really, really cool. A lot of detail in there. I love it. Uh,. And as for the beam, the beam it fires, it's kind of a little awkward when it fires up like that, but the custom sound, and just the fact that it's always a beam, that's, that is awesome. And, uh, so you can technically aim, you almost prefer to do it this way, even though you don't really have to, it's, you just aim like that, and it's, uh, of course, a laser, so you really don't need to. But let's, uh, let's check out some other stuff, the mods for it, um... I don't know, ask somebody I'm gonna do, uh, use my duplicator mod, that's a different mod I have, so we can see the unfinished version, and the finished one. A uh, refinished, I guess I should say. Trying to go someplace where it's a little bit better to see shit. And <laughs> they're gonna fall, they're gonna fall down here. Okay, let's go somewhere else. Um, let's go over to... Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Prim. You know, prim, so you get a bit better a little a bit better look at this gun. And um you're gonna see if the game crashes. Because problem oh no, it didn't crash. Alright, that's hello. Yeah, that's the uh, hit effect on a uh, wall or something there, so I'm not that cool, but you know. Alright, again, so here you see the unmodified version there. And now I'm going to go into, um, let's... Phaser Rig Finishing Kit. And see here that fix the little top part so it's not like all broken right there. Let's see some of the other stuff. Scratches are gone. All this coolness, this coolness on this weapon. Oh yeah. See there? All shiny and new, like it just came out of Admiral Quinn's asshole. If, you, if that's an STO, STO joke, if Star Trek and Uh, but yes, and see, it still fires the same. I think it fires a little faster, and if you look at the effect it has there, so yeah, that's it. It's an awkward looking deal, but I mean, I kind of like it. It's interesting. It's, a little, it's like it vaporizes the air around it. Like an air riser. Alright, but there's that one. I'm going to switch right back over to the unmodified one. And see, there you can see the little broken there. Little broken thing. Scratches. Scratches on this thing. Where's the sunlight? Where's the light over here? Let's get some, some light on this. Yeah, we can see. Again, this one has more scratches. It's freaking all dirty. Because, you know, the, the, the dude was firing with it and he got scratched up because he was playing in the. Uh, he was playing throw the phaser against the walls and, you know, you play that game and your phaser gets all broken. That's, uh, that's what happens. And, uh, I don't really much like the, uh, other one, the, uh, extended mod, mag, I don't like extended mag mods. They, I mean, it's cool that they adds extra capacity, but it, that idea of it sticking out of the end of the barrel is, so it's why I'm not going to use it on the other one. But, um, yeah, you see, uh, just a phaser with extended mags just... Now that's that's it adds like a 
100 and 100 there for the ammo. So let's go over to uh, the other one. And you see standard capacity there, it's what it looks like. And it's a uh, 50 out of 150. So yeah, it holds 100 and you get 100 with it. So uh, I think, uh, let's try something here. Pretty sure that it uh, doesn't, yeah, I thought for a second it did regenerate, but um, no, you have to, uh, I think it was a like crafting, you have to craft the ammo for it out of stuff. But, you know, that's that's not bad. That's actually pretty cool. And, um, let's just take this over here. And go find some bad guys to kill. Now, I have found, uh, just hip-shooting this thing, that it tends to... Kinda tends to, like, shoot the weapons and everything first. Awkwardly enough. Which, I mean, isn't bad. It's kinda cool to just, like, randomly shoot at someone, disable their weapon, if... You know, that way they don't shoot at you, but it's it gets annoying if you just want to keep shooting at them. Because yeah, I've done that, it's like, oh, lovely, I, I shoot your weapon at your hands. Now you just go over and beat up my companions, that's lovely. But yeah, aside from that, it's pretty awesome, and it has a unique effect um, that I can show if we find any uh, anything evil around here, which... I guess I've killed everything off in existence, but, you know, let's just warp somewhere. Alright, um... Let's go to the map. Let's go. Where's the, where's the place to go? Um... New Vegas? Monte Carlo Suites. I think there's the, uh... Whatchamacallit's there. Ah, Raiders. I'm ra not Raiders. I don't know what they're called. Um... Oh yeah, there's thingies that are bad. Scorpions! See, now that's the effect and it is awesome. But does it do that every single time? Well, let's just see. Hmm. I don't know what you're doing. Yeah, it might not always hit, so... And now it, uh, doesn't seem to be shooting the weapons out like I said it did for me, but, you know. Let's just... Oh, yes, of course, you go, go behind the wall. You're jackass for that. Oh, look, no more shotgun. What do you got now? What do you shoot me with it now? Oh, nothing? You don't shoot me... Yeah, it doesn't really matter where you shoot them. They pretty much vaporize all the time. Alright, let's give this gerbil some dick. Gerbil dicked. Dude, you, you just gonna be rubbing hamster on me all night long. Where, where are you? There you, there you go, jackass. Unroller, I don't even know who you are, nor, I, nor do I care. Anyway, that is the phaser mod, and it is freaking awesome. The only things I really don't much like is that. It's weird, but all the weapons do that. And if you aim, it's really cool. It seems to be way better. But yeah, it's a great weapon. Um, it still only uses one energy thing per shot. It comes with a lot of ammo. And you can craft stuff with it for the ammo. And I think there's nothing you can craft, but I'm not quite sure. Um, I will put the link up for the description and all this for this wonderful, cool-ass Star Trek weapon. So, you know, if you like Star Trek and you want a, a weapon like it, this is, of course, like I said, from the second turn. Ugh. What do you want to call it? Fifth generation one? JJ's Trek. But, uh, yeah. Just an awesome little mod. It's cool. You should totally download it and then play it. And, Kylie, I did this one mostly for you. Mm hmm. Uh, yes. Well, good night and have a good time pick taking all those fish out your pockets because I have no way to put a duck in here.